Our group was given the organization Call to Care to sponsor and help in any ways possible. Call to Care is a Christian-based foster organization that provides care to foster children. We began our work with a group decision to focus on getting supplies for the foster children in need. What some people don't realize is that these children are taken from their homes at any time, day or night, sometimes with only the clothes on their back, and are put into foster care. If no homes are available to take in the children, they are put in a hotel room until they can be placed in a proper home. Their whole lives change in a matter of hours, going from one house to another with new people and even sometimes new schools or an entirely new area. Most people think of babies or young children when thinking of foster kids, but these kids can range anywhere from newborns to 18 year olds and can extend to the age of 19 if they are still enrolled in public school. This can be a hard and sad situation for any child to go through, so we decided that we wanted to help. We wanted to make our impact with the community's help, so we decided to primarily focus on serving and still ended up with about $140 donated to our cause as well. Every kid put into the system through Call to Care is given what we call a journey bag. These bags consist of hygiene products, a stuffed animal, some clothes, and a Bible. Sometimes this is all the children have with them when moving to new homes, and it was our job to make sure they got these journey bags by stocking them for them. We began our journey with a Bible drive, collecting over 200 Bibles from different churches throughout our community. The next step we took was our journey drive, which took place every day at VHS to collect Bibles with the help of Fellowship of Christian Athletes Club, which kept a box for us where students, teachers, and faculty and staff could drop off Bibles for us to collect. These next few pictures seen are from collecting the Bibles and storing them until we got a chance to deliver them to the Call to Care facility. As a group, we ventured into the community to reach out for as much supplies as possible. To do this, we hosted another drive called the Call to Care Hygiene Drive. Our group stood outside collecting any and all donations we could get to donate to the foster organization, including tissues, wipes, toothbrushes and toothpaste, combs, and much more. To wrap up our project, we met at the Call to Care office and helped pack the journey bags. We used all the supplies we gathered and past supplies that was already collected at the facility to make all the bags we could. We not only packed bags, but sorted clothes, supplies, and just helped wherever possible so that we could make a positive impact in any way we could. Our project has already benefited the community as we heard from Call to Care that the bags were immediately given out to foster children. We were all so blessed to have this opportunity to help out our local community and will continue to make a difference in our everyday lives in some way or another. Thank you for your time and have a great rest of your day. My favorite part about working with Call to Care was holding the signs and making the journey bags. One thing I learned was how to interact well with others throughout our community. My favorite part of this project was getting to go to Call to Care and pack the journey bags, as well as just serving the community with my friends. My favorite thing about the Leadership Miles program was getting to tour our local businesses and just sort of how they operate and um, getting to help children with the Call to Care program. Hi, my name is Sarah Beth. My favorite part of the community service project was most definitely stuffing the journey bags. Um, I was able to stuff hygiene products into them and it was really fun. My favorite part of the project was the hygiene drive because I like waving the signs at cars.